Welcome to a deep dive into the turbulent waters of restaurant finance. Today, our focus is Red Lobster. Picture this, the once titan of seafood dining, a beacon of affordable luxury for middle-class America, is now teetering on the edge of bankruptcy. Red Lobster, owned by Thai Union Group, has been grappling with a tide of financial woes. Amid leadership crises, strategic blunders, and the economic onslaught of the COVID-19 pandemic, the company is reportedly considering filing for Chapter 11 bankruptcy protection to restructure its debt. Jonathan Tybus, the new CEO, has been thrust into the eye of the financial storm. In the words of Tybus, we're in the midst of a challenging period. However, we remain committed to our customers and staff and are doing everything we can to navigate these troubled waters. Tybus, the third CEO in two years, has a Herculean task ahead. Financial experts have been closely monitoring the situation. Renowned economist Dr. Jane Bennett explains the potential implications if Red Lobster files for bankruptcy, it could send shockwaves through the restaurant industry. This would not only affect the employees and the supply chain, but could also upset the equilibrium of the dining market. The parent company, Thai Union Group, is seeking to sell Red Lobster after suffering a staggering $33 million loss in 2022. The company has already closed 16 locations and is actively in talks to divest from long-term contracts and renegotiate leases. Despite the severity of the situation, Red Lobster's management has not yet made an official decision on bankruptcy. This leaves employees, customers, and investors in a state of suspense. Financial analyst Mark Sullivan weighs in, Red Lobster's potential bankruptcy is a stark reminder of the precarious nature of the restaurant industry. It's a domino effect. If one falls, it could start a chain reaction. As we cast a final glance at the turbulent seas of Red Lobster's financial struggles, here are the key takeaways. Firstly, the potential bankruptcy of Red Lobster could have a ripple effect on the restaurant industry, affecting employees, supply chains, and the dining market. Secondly, the situation underscores the importance of effective leadership and strategic decision-making in navigating economic challenges. And finally, it serves as a stark reminder of the volatile nature of the restaurant industry where change is the only constant. As we wrap up, remember, the story of Red Lobster is not just about a single company struggle, but a mirror reflecting the broader challenges faced by the restaurant industry. It's a tale of resilience in the face of adversity, a testament to the spirit of those who keep pushing even when the tide is against them.